hello what's up guys in this video I will give you uh, a lot of information about how to be a good developer there is a lot of things that you have uh, to learn the first thing in uh, our par experience is learn what algorithms here I mean that you have to know how things works and this is based on um, important uh, an important thing that is known in programming a logic okay so here you will learn how things works by applying your logic and imagination so in this first step you will improve your logic okay you will learn also the organigrams okay for example here this is the first step step one when the algorithms start and here for example we have to calculate something after that we have conditions and return or the end etc in general here in the first step you will learn the basis of programming and the basis of programming are algorithms logics uh, imagination etc and also you will learn how to create algorithms I mean their syntax because the algorithms are totally different in comparison with programs and codes the algorithms can be read by anyone okay for example your father your mother but programs are complex and need uh, a lot of knowledge so this is the first step now we go to the second step the second step is learn languages but what programming languages for example C C++ Python Java uh, JavaScript GS etc there is a lot of programming languages okay so in my experience the C is the first language that you have to learn because it is not complicated in comparison with C++ and Java Python is simple and easy but it is more complex than C okay so the syntax is also different from 
one language to another one so this is the second step you have to choose a language and to choose a language you have to uh, choose before that which field you will uh, work in in the future for example there is a lot of domains in programming for example mobile development web development desktop application development machine learning data science etc so you have to choose first which domain I will work in in the future okay this is the second step now may someone ask me a question is this enough learning algorithms and learning languages to be a good developer the answer is no you can do uh, small projects for example uh, building something that can be uh, executed in your computer or anything but when it comes to uh, big projects and uh, collaboration with other people in the world and in your company for example you have to learn what frame works the frameworks are like boxes okay that contain a lot of tools okay and for each domain here there is a special framework for example in mobile development we have flutter in web development we have Django that is based on Python there is PHP Laravel and so on so this is a general roadmap for anyone to be a good developer if you have another questions or anything please let me know in the comments I will teach you anything you want and we can uh, give you special courses in programming for anyone who want to be a good developer for good prices thank you for watching this video and please if you are not subscribed in this channel so do that now thank you for watching